After two burglaries this spring, a nonprofit in Hartford is trying to get back on its feet now and has the help of the federal government. News H. Jane Chaka live outside Angel of Edgewood with more on that. Jane. Darren Angel of Edgewood has had a tough year with illegal dumping in their parking lot and then two break ins happening days within each other. Now they have hope for what's to come and big plans for their new facility. Snap it. Yay. We're just grateful. I don't think any words can describe how excited I am um, to, to be here and to have people go along and, and support my vision. That vision feeding the community and fighting poverty in Hartford. Angel of Edgewood provides food, clothes and resources to families in need. All of it led by Jendiah Scott Miller. She doesn't sleep. She works seven days a week. I get text messages at six in the morning and 11 o'clock at night. A great community asset that is that gives back to the community more than anyone knows. Scott Miller wants to turn this newly acquired space into a community hub for collaboration between nonprofits and charities so she can help as many people as she can. Growing up, I, I wasn't allowed to dream, so that's why I dream really big. The 17,000 square foot warehouse will become a cafe, kitchen, offices and more. Those plans came to a halt when the facility was burglarized twice within days this spring. Scott Miller believes they took more than $50,000 worth of donated supplies and copper lined pipes. But the community rallied behind her. She received a grant to install a security system and today Senator Richard Blumenthal announced that $709,000 in federal funding are coming to help them renovate and expand. Scott Miller took the senator on a tour of the building to see what she wants the space to become. It was one thing to just send money, but it's another to see the impact in place. And police say they have an arrest warrant out for one of the suspects involved. As for the facility, there's still a lot of work to be done before it's up and running. In the meantime, they have their back to school extravaganza at Duncan Park on August 23rd. Angel of Edgewood is hosting that once again. In Hartford, Jane Chaco, News 8.